Hi there YouTube friends, this is David from Dax Leather. Thank you for joining me once again for another review and update video. Today we're going to be looking at a raw natural shell cordon wallet that I've caught for just over a month now and what I want to show you in this video is how this leather has behaved so far after using it daily for exactly one month. The wallet I've got here is an Ashland Leather Money Clip. It's an amazing minimalist wallet with four car slots and a very tough brass clip holder. Now in this video I'm not going to review the wallet, rather I'll focus exclusively on how the leather has behaved so far. If you've been following the channel, you'll know that I'm a big fan of Shell Cordovan and like to work with it every now and then when I have the opportunity to do so. And while I tend to bend towards the dark classic Cordovan leather colors like black and colorate, I wanted to see how the patina develops on a raw natural piece since it's a very rare Cordovan color and was very curious about it. So when I first got the wallet, my first impression with this leather was that it feels very different from any other Cordovan pieces I've worked with. Brand new, it doesn't have any luster at all and feels almost like a very fine suede leather. It's hard to describe it since it's not like suede, it just doesn't feel glass smooth at all. It's more like a very fine velvet feel. Now, the wallet had all the other characteristics that you'll see in any other Horwin Shell Cordon wallet, like uh, the particular smell of the leather, the cracking sound when you bend it, and the stiffness when introducing cards in the slots. The shine and texture are the only things different in this particular leather, however, you can expect all the other unique characteristics that you'll find in a Cordovan piece when it's new. Now here you're looking at the wallet one week old and uh, you can see how it has developed a slight patina on its surface, a very light polished feel and when I flip the wallet you start to see some patina developing on the back side, especially where the card sits in the slot. To make it fair I only use one card on each of the other slots and this darker side always faces my jeans outwards. The more uh, clean looking side is always facing my body. On the inside you can also notice slight signs of wear from the friction that's going on with the bills and the same leather but other than that this part of the wallet looks almost like new. And here is the interesting part. This time we see the wallet, how it looks with exactly one month of use. You can see the patina has increased drastically on both sides, especially the back side of the wallet. The marks of the card slots increase considerably and the shine of the wallet is also much more evident. And because the inner sides still look relatively new, you can easily make a comparison of the patina and crocking that is going on on the outer surface. Now one thing I want to emphasize here is how the leather actually feels to the touch. We know this is Shell Corvan and that this leather feels rather unique to other leathers, however I must add that at this point the shell feels more like baqueta and not so much like a Corvan leather. And this gives you a rather strange sensation since uh, if you have some Shell Corvan wallets or boots you know that as the leather ages it becomes more polished and obtains a plastic kind of feel. Yet raw natural shell doesn't feel like that at all, at least for the time being.
and as I said in the beginning of the video, I just wanted to give a quick review and update on how this raw natural shell leather behaves and what you can actually expect in the short term while using it. So friends, thank you so much for watching this review. I'll be posting more updates of the raw natural shell so you can see how its patina continues to develop. Also, if you're into leather crafting, please consider subscribing to the channel. In the meanwhile, I hope you enjoyed the video and find it useful. I leave you with a few more shots of the wallet and hope to see you again very soon. Have a great day.